Well, good morning. This is your roving reporter. There's his shadow anyway. This is he. Um, up at Devonshire Tunnel. It's uh, Saturday. Something like the uh, 11th, I think, of February. Lovely sunny day. Beautiful. Um, I'm just going down to Preston for a cup of tea and a bun. Before I do, I thought I'd just uh, take a little look down the, uh, the path to see how far we've got. I'm pleased to report that we've got about uh, another, well, in total we've got about, I think, about 700 metres of uh, tarmac laid now. Um, so without further ado, let's take a, a slow ride down to have a look. First time on the, uh, first time riding on the tarmac. Great. Apologies for you people that have seen the first bit before, but uh, first time by bike. Side, but that seems to have, we've had quite a lot of rain so doesn't seem to be a major drainage problem there. It does have a touch of uh, spring in the air. where the council are doing a bit more work because the bridge has actually been subsiding slightly. I'll show you a bit of a clip of the uh, underpinning shortly. And here you can actually see a uh, there's quite a crack in the uh, in the side of the bridge there. So that's what's in the process of uh, being rectified. Uh, and so the, for anyone that knows this area, here are the railings. And a few days ago the railings had spikes on them. Well, they haven't got spikes anymore. They've all been cut off. For health and safety reasons. Hi there. Hi. So uh, a short stretch while that's being sorted out and tarmac resumes here. I'm not sure if this is new fencing on the side or whether that's always been there. I thought this uh, tarmac was a bit lumpy but actually it's certainly this part is nice and smooth. Hello there. So this is uh, somewhere around here. There's the school through the trees. And there will be a, uh, a ramp going down to the school. Somewhere down here. A little bit of a bench gone in.
way out. This is where the tarmac stops. Uh, is the hydro compound. And just in the foreground there is Muxdale Road. <coughs> so uh, this is this has been left untarmacked uh, because of course footings and so on. Drop for all your hard work. It's coming out to Monsdale Road. This is where things end for the moment, and then there's from Monday. Mark will be starting across the road there. So the Harris fence has gone up uh, in advance. No, good news. Um, it's been pretty good. Stay tuned for more uh, more reports later on. You can see the, uh, the spikes being cut off the railings at the Scotts Dryer Bridge. Presumably an health and safety issue in case anybody impales their arm on it. And also, still at the Scotts Dryer Bridge, the, uh, there's some interesting work going on with resin, which you can see in those uh, drums in the van, being injected into the, um, below the bridge to actually uh, raise the bridge up because uh, it's sunk at some point. So, uh, thereby maintaining the integrity of the bridge, hopefully, for, uh, for many years to come. Very interesting. And for all Twitter fans, you can now tweet on the project. Just go to Twitter and look for Two Tunnels Bath. <laughs>